welcome friends in this video we are going to learn about rotational blend in creo parametric first we have to select a plane which you want to sketch and make it for sketch on view and draw the center rectangle and specify the dimensions as per requirement please maintain the minimum thickness value for the component which we make a rotational blend if you have a higher amount of thickness the rotational blend cannot be applicable so maintain a minimum thickness in the range of value just go for extrusion and make the extrusion value based upon your requirement and just click ok this is the base part which i am going to make a rotational blend so we have to make just a cosmetic application of the tire make it for sketch on view and draw the tire profile such as knurling profile just draw a rectangle parallelogram rectangle draw it on the face of rectangle specify the dimension value for the rectangle profile just click ok then go for extrude inside the extrude we have to choose a remove material option to make a cut on the rectangular component you have to specify the depth value for the cut then click ok after that you have to make a different color view for good appearance and understanding then go for the model in the model we have to select a pattern go for the pattern inside the pattern we have to select a directional pattern just select edge as a reference for making a pattern make a flip direction and give the number of instances to be produced and specify the in between distance of them then click ok after that you have to choose the both pattern and extrude cut and make it for the linear pattern just go for the direction option and select a edge as a reference to apply the direction pattern and specify the number of instances to be produced and then you have to specify the in between distance theme and click ok then you have to make a mirror of this at a opposite side so just select a mid plane go for the mirror option then go for the model and select a mid plane as a reference make sure you have to previously select the features which we want to mirror just select a pattern and go for mirror and select a mid plane now the pattern is successfully mirrored now we have go into the concept of rotational blend just go for the shapes option for making a rotational blend or go for the engineering and select a torsional blend then go for references and click a solid geometry and go for the define the profile of toroidal blend and go for the sketch make it for sketch on view then we have to make a references at all the edges of the rectangular profile in the toroidal blend we have to place a coordination system must then we have to draw a open sketch with the fillet 
just place a coordination system in the component then draw a open profile make sure your profile cannot be contain a shop corners so please make a fill that in your open sketches whether it have a open corners sorry shop corners after that you have to just click okay now the component is bend toroidal along the profile you can make as a 360 degree bend specify the and select the both opposite face rectangle to make a complete rotational of component now the toroidal blend component is created here just click okay hide all the planes for better visualization now you have go for the views and apply the different color for good appearance of the toroidal blend component to get regular updates of my video please subscribe in my channel if you have any doubts in this command post in my channel thanks for watching inshallah we will meet in next video Don't